Hey, what's up, YouTube? Arc Random here, and welcome back to the Pokemon White 2 Randomized Nuzlocke Let's Play. And this time, uh, I've made a lot of bad decisions in this in this uh, whole video series, like losing Pokemon and stuff like that. Um, now I'm about to make the worst decision of all, and that is fighting the Elite Four. Uh, in the party right now, I am running with Shiri, the Scizor, Katara, the Suicune, Juvia, the Palkia, Poof, the Staraptor, Azula, the... Infernape and turn up the Cacturn. Um, <laughs> uh, I'm under leveled right now. Well, two of my Pokemon are like at great levels. The rest of my Pokemon are under leveled. And so I'm actually just going to play it like that because that sounds like it'll be more interesting. And uh, the grinding montage was already absurdly long. So I didn't want to make that any longer than it needed to be. Um, I'm going to move some items around, give people items and stuff, you know. Get prepared. Get prepared for what's coming. Alright. Let's see. Let's give Juvia the Rocky helmet. I don't know. Why not? Alright. So, uh, if you saw in the Grand Montage, we're switching around the party a little bit. I got that. I pulled like a Kadabra or something, or an Abra in the cave, and I decided I don't want this because um, its nature was really bad. And so I put Cacturn in the party, but I didn't end up like leveling up or anything. So we're going to start off right now with the Pokemon League. The Pokemon League is a place where you both pursue strength and express it. The way the ex to express it is simple you just have to beat the Elite Four and the Champion. You can start your challenge by battling any of the Elite Four, and if you defeat them all, you can challenge the Champion. However, I warn you, once you start the challenge, there's no turning back. You must continue to battle until you defeat them all, or you are defeated yourself. Do you want to go in? Yes. Yes, I do. Then proceed! Alright, so I'm pretty sure all of them are around level 53, and then their aces are 56. So, uh, since it's randomized, it really doesn't matter which one I go into first. Um, because no telling what any of them are going to have. Alright, so, now, we begin with the ghost trainer? Yeah, this is the ghost trainer. Donna. <laughs> Her room's so cool. There is one man who wanders the world with a white dragon Pokemon to search for the truth. That's part of the novel I'm writing. I want to write down the events that happened today. Sorry, it has nothing to do with you. You're a challenger, right? I'm the Elite Force Ghost type user, Chantal. And I shall be your opponent. Chantal, the ghost trainer. Um... I remember the first time I played through Black and White, the first one, I had so much trouble with her Chandelure, it beat the shit out of me. So, let's see. Okay, a Rhyperior. That's great. Awesome. Oh, and it's level 56. I was mistaken on the level. Well, um, the Palkia Sweep begins now. <laughs> um, with this randomizer, they are like full random. Like, there's no, there's no single type or anything. Which, um, if you started watching the Pokemon Ruby and Sapphire Let's Play that me and my fiance started playing, um, you'd see like that we're running through and we're using things like, uh, what is it? We're running, we're seeing trainers that have like all one type of Pokemon and everything. Because that's how I set that randomizer. This time, it's just, it is full random. So it's been the whole game. No, no specific types or anything. Like, no telling what they're going to send out. Like, here's an Octillery. Like, this guy could have just, like, scrub Pokemon. You know what? It's, an, it's a single Octillery. I think I could take it. I think Turnip can do it. Let's see. What's he going to know? He's not going to know Aura Beam or anything, I don't think. I'm going to Leech Seed him. Signal Beam! Okay. Well, bye, Turnip. I'm sorry, I put you into the party just for this. Well, okay. I'm a bad trainer. All right, let's go out to let's go out to Sherry the Scizor. Oh man, why did I even bring him? That's not cool. I'm bad. I'm bad. Uh, I'm gonna try and iron head it and just like flinch hacks it out. Hydro pump. Oh my god. Why do you hurt so much? Oh my god. Stop killing me. That's I I'm not I'm not okay with this. I don't want to just keep using Palkia, because honestly I think I could solo run this Palkia. I think I'm gonna have to. But. 
So, it looks like Palkia it is. Palkia is going to just raffle stomp through this. That's, that's my only option. That's really my only choice right now, is just to run through with Palkia. Um, this, oct this artillery is doing a surprising amount of damage. Okay. So he ate that one up. Let's, uh, let's spatial rend. Why not? Signature move. Just do the damages. Do the do. And... Why not? Alright. Let's see. And... Da, 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 da. Shuri gained a booster. Why does Shuri gain a Oh, he's got the... Lucky egg. Semi-seer. Alright. Easy enough. I can take that. Um, and I'm just gonna serve him down. Uh, I don't know if I should start conserving certain PP, because I could have probably earth-powered him and held on to a surf. <laughs> okay, he's giving me so much encouragement right now. <laughs> she just walks over in here, don't fuck up. Thanks. Thanks. Love you. Mean it. Uh, Alright. It's a clefable. So, I'm gonna try and punch it really hard. That's my only option, really. You go, Shonen Hero. So go. Just punch it. Just punch it with all your force. All your might. Although, if it survives, it'll probably survive on low health and get healed. Thank God. Azula, you're a beast. Oh, that was a crit. That was a crit close combat from an Infernape. Nothing's living that. Nothing will survive that. Probably. Crit probably mattered there. <laughs> um, but Azula leveled up, so that's all that matters. We almost learn acrobatics now. It's not the time. It's not the time. Chantal. Oh my god. Alright. My Pokemon and the Challengers Pokemon. Everyone battled through. They were hurt? <laughs> battled through even though they were hurt. Thank you. Alright. So, uh, let's run the heels. Can I run? What can I give to people that would help? Oh. I'm gonna give a scope lens to Shuri. I'm gonna take your lucky egg. You know what? I'm gonna make this. Yeah, I'm gonna have to cheese this out. I'm going to go ahead and give the uh lucky egg to um Juvia right now. Cause I don't think that Rocky Helmet's gonna do much for me. Um, Rocky Helmet's probably gonna do more on Suicune, to be totally honest. Um, and then let's heal up. I have HP ups. What? Did you eat it? Nope. Cool. Uh, nope, nope, nope. Special defense boost? Maybe? Maybe? Yeah. Alright, so healing up. I'm sorry, Turniphead. I brought you in just for you to be defeated like this. I'm bad. I'm bad. No, Cack turn. I was like, oh, I'll use Cacturn against Octillery, and then uh, apparently Octillery knew Signal Beam, which Cacturn is four times weak to. Oh. I did not expect an Octillery to know that. I was thinking, like, uh, at most I'd have to be afraid of, like, Aura Beam. But, uh, as it turns out... Oh, yeah, this is the Dark Trainer. This dude's like a vampire. He's totally a vampire. What will be determined of us here can only be absorbed... Which of us can absorb the opponent's light and shine? Because he's a vampire, he's going to absorb my blood. Who will decide that? It shall be I, Grimsley of the Elite Four! And I will fulfill my duty to you to be your opponent. Grimsley. <laughs> Alright. Elite Four Grimsley. I'm so glad they only have four Pokemon. Oh my god. Of course it's a nice Pokemon. Of course it's a nice Pokemon. Alright, so I'm going to Iron Head it. For some reason, I thought Hapaki out first, which was which would have been depressing. How is Vanillux faster? I think I have a speed lowering nature. Um. Ooh, why would you use that move? No, don't set up hail. Stop that. Please don't hail set on me. <laughs> I mean, it's gonna hurt the rest of his team, I'm sure, because he probably doesn't have any more ice Pokemon. Alright, there's Shuri hitting level 60. I don't know why I chose to level up Scizor, but I felt like it was just like, oh, it's a Steel-type. Steel-type's going to be really useful in this. So I'm going to level up Steel-type and see what I can do. I'm just send in Rhydon. Um, I'd like to keep in... I'd like to do that. You know what? I bet Katara can fight Rhydon. Even though it's only level 47, I bet Katara can fight this Rhydon. I don't know why Rhydon would know anything that could hurt me. 
So I'm gonna go ahead and try it. Oh, this is the ace. That's his ace level. And I'm faster. See, see, okay. Scissor was not faster than the Vanillux, but Suicune at level 47 was faster than level 58 right on. What? I don't, I don't understand. Why do, why do water Pokemon get buffeted by hail? I don't understand. Alright. Oh, I need a grass move. I don't have a grass move. I guess it's Juvia's turn then. Uh, I guess I can throw an Aura Sphere at it. Aura Sphere's probably my best bet on that thing. Since it's a uh, rock type. Um, Corsola. Level 56 Corsola. So scary. The great thing about Palkia's typing is Palkia is like, is like neutral damage to, uh, Ice type, which is great. His only real weakness is dragon, and my Impalkia is bulky enough they could probably take a dragon move. But I also have Scizor, so I don't really need to take the dragon moves because I have a Scizor. That's a patch rat. <laughs> Your last Pokemon is a patch rat. I'm so sorry. I'm I'm hoping one of the Elite Fours, at least one of the Elite Fours, is just full of just scrub Pokemon, like Pokemon that just can't do anything against me. Although they may be asking for too much because um, what's his face? Getsus had nothing but um, scrub first evolution Pokemon except for like an Aggron. Like, look at that special attack. 242 special attack. He has maxed EVs in special attack right now because he had the, uh, he had that, that power lens for so long. He's just a beast. He's just going to tank it all up. Alright. There's a winner. There's also a loser. It's pathetic to make a big deal out of it. If you're a Pokemon, if you're a true Pokemon battler, you'll reflect upon this loss and think about how you'll win next time. You mean you? Whether or not you get the fight to full strength, or you, or whether or not you luck, bleh, words are hard. Whether or not luck smiles on you, none of that matters. The only result matters, and the loss is a loss. See, victory shines like a bright light, and now you and your Pokemon are shining brilliantly. Oh, well, thank you. I don't want you to talk about shining light because I mean he's the dark trainer. Well, let's heal up. Okay. And I'm using the Hyper Potions because I've got, like, extra Hyper Potions left over. So I figure just hold on to those. Okay. Let's run on up in here. This is... What is this one? I forgot which one this is. She's psychic, isn't she? Oh my god, her room. I forgot about this room. Oh my goodness, I forgot about this room. Shit. It's me who appeared when the flower opened up. You stand over there. You look like a Pokemon trainer with strength and kindness. I would look for in my opponent is superb strength. I'm counting on you. Do 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 do. Caitlyn, what is her face? Well, she's making a weird face. Lead for Caitlyn. All right, she is the psychic Pokemon. She has a Wormadam. <laughs> Wormadam. What a Wormadam now. Anticipation made it shudder. I must mean I have something super effective against. Oh, I have Acrobat. Here, let's acrobat him. I know I, d I have like an item in my hand still, so it doesn't do as much damage, or it does that much damage, and it one shots. I could be mistaken. Zula fifty three, hell yeah, go Zula. Cling clang, cling clang, cling clang. Uh, uh, if I had something better than fire spin, I might do that. You know what? I have Juvia. Juvia can handle that. I'm afraid of Kling Clang, because Kling Clang can probably eat up Fire Spin pretty easily. So, here comes Palkia's uh, Aura Sphere. Let's do Aura Sphere. Wait, does he have Levitate? I don't think he has Levitate. Let's Earth Power. Yeah, there were Kling Clangs in the cave, and I was like, do these things Levitate? And I found out, no, I can Earth Power them. So, that's pretty good. Doo -doo. Alright, boosted. Get boosted. That's in an Unfazant. Oh, I kind of I want to fight Unfazant with my Pokemon, but at the same time I don't. I think Katara can handle that, even though it's a low level. I mean, Suicune's bulky enough that I'm not afraid of it lo losing out in any battles, even though it's such a low level compared to these guys, especially when he's got type advantage. Oh, it's the female one. Female Unfazant looks weird. <laughs> looks like a turkey. Facade. It's naturally accurate, yep, it is a naturally accurate pheasant. Um, male Unfazant has like the crazy red eyebrow things that go around its face. Well, no, I mean, that's what's accurate about it. In the wild, yeah. male birds are the ones that have the, the colors, colors and everything. And all of that, and female birds just look like scrubs. 
Alright. He's gonna use swagger. Oh shit. That could have sucked. Alright. Um, I'm gonna heal up real fast. Because I don't want to get swaggered. Oh. Full restore. Nice. So, let's see. Is he gonna try and swagger me again? If he tries to swagger me, then I, th I may be able to just do more damage with a certain move. With... Nope, all my moves are special. Oh, please don't. Please don't. I hate Swagger. I fucking hate that move. Swagger is the worst. Alright. Aura Beam is not doing as much damage as I want it to. Oh, I lowered its attack! I may stay in. I didn't know Aura Beam did that. Whipped up a Whirlwind. He's starting for a Razor Wind. Ooh, two Aura Beams. Razor Wind is special, I believe. I'm a little scared of hurting myself in confusion. Do I have a Prism Berry, maybe? Oh, is this... Heals all the Sash effects. Here, have, a, have an Ice Cream Cone. I'm going to heal the confusion real fast. And see what he... See how much damage Razor Wind does. Okay, that didn't do as much as I thought it would. So, yeah, I'll just go ahead and Orbeam him one more time. Oh, but he's going to swagger me again, which sucks. I'm going to, like, s take out a quarter of my own health with this. Oh, it's going to hurt. Uh, Orbeam. Oh, nice. Uh, I'm replaying X and Y, and at one point I fought a, uh, Snorlax that had Belly Drum. And so this... No, not a Snorlax. A Makuhita that had Belly Drum. And so he Belly Drummed up, and then I he used Confused Ray, and he hit himself for half his HP. Alright, uh, so he's whipping up a razor wind again. Cool, I can take this. Please snap out. Ooh. You hurt me. Hurt my good. Nice! No confuse hacks this time. I did not take any confusion damage. Sweet. Go Katara. Nice, nice, nice. Alright, Superior. I um again, if you had better moves. I'm gonna run out to Sherry and I'm gonna go ahead and go for a uh a nice and powerful X Scizor. Try and cut him down pretty quickly. Superiors are pretty cool. I like Superior. I just wish they would release his hidden ability. Oh my god, a contrary superior would do so much. That'd be one of the most OP uh starters ever. Ooh, coil. Ooh, ooh, what? That's a cool setup. Ooh. Alright, I'm actually going for, like, lucky crits right now, because I know that I have the scope lens. Gastro acid. Ability was suppressed. So he suppressed my technician? I'm not relying on technician or any, but it's a bit weird that he could do that. Alright. Okay, so that's three Elite Four members down. That is three down so far. Um... Alright, you haven't faced all the members of the Elite Four yet, have you? Don't concern yourself about me, go on ahead. Alright, so now we're on the last one, which I believe is the fighting Elite Four member. The original fighting one, who gave uh, me and my friends so much trouble in the uh, in our versus of Black and White. Because uh, he's got some good... he had some good Pokemon. Now, unfortunately, he, uh, he may have some scrubs. Hoping for scrubs! <laughs> Hoping and praying for scrubs! Let's see what we got. Oh my god, his gym looks so much cooler in this. I didn't like I didn't like his room previously. Bah. He's cool. His is almost as cool as Wick Wickstrom's intro in X and Y. I'm the number one pupil of my mentor, Alder. In order to master the art of fighting, I've kept training. And you're also walking a similar path to your Pokemon. It's my intention to test you and take you to the limits of your training. Gah! I picture him sounding. This is Marshall. Oh, that <laughs> Sounds about right. He looks, like he looks like he does look like a throw. He has a Gorbis. Interesting. Starting with a water Pokemon. Um, I don't know if I want to keep Sherry in against this. I think I'm gonna switch out to Juvia. Let's see. I'm not sure what it was gonna use. If he goes for a Scald, that'd be upsetting. But I don't really know what Gorbis learns. Hydro Pump. Okay. I know Gorbis is definitely faster than my, uh, 
than my Scizor. So far we're playing through and I've only used two Spatial Wrens and I haven't been relying on Palkia too much, so I'm feeling pretty good about the champion battle. Palkia is still pretty good on PP, as is uh, Scizor. Mian Fu. Mian Fu, Mian Fu. Poof might be a good choice against this, because he doesn't have a specialized set, does he? Wait, he usually has a Mian Fu. Wait, is that Mian Chao? He usually has a Mian Chao, doesn't he? This is a Mian, this is the first form, I think. I get this mixed up all the time. It is, it's the first form, cool. And I got the Intimidate drop, so Ghost to Raptor. I'm gonna go ahead and fly. I don't want to go for the. Oh, God. I don't want to go for the Brave Bird and hurt myself. That doesn't sound like a fun experience for me. So. Especially since I'll do, like, most of his damage. Oh, yes. Okay, so fly one shot. So I didn't need to Brave Bird at all. Cool. So not taking any damage. Azula level 54. Nice. Look at that speed. 138 speed. Onyx. Onyx, Onyx, Onyx. Let's use Katara. I don't think there's any reason to be afraid of an Onyx for a Katara. Um, it'll probably survive with Sturdy, but uh, I may get the Burn Hacks, which could be funny. Go for the Burn with Scald and get the Hacks. Alright, so this guy's running a couple of first Evos. Uh, a Gorbis, not first Evo, but the Onyx and the... Uh... Oh, there's the Burn Hacks. Yeah, so it's still technically a one-shot. Uh, but he does Stone Edge me. Ooh. That didn't do anything. Wow. That was... Look at Katara, like, eating up the hits. I love Suicunes. Suicunes are so beastly. They take no damage. And a Beldum. See, this is the one that Azula can fight. Azula can use flame Fire Spin on a Beldum. I believe in that. It's just going to take down me. I think it should still only no takedown. I could have plotted and tried to see if Fire Spin could do more damage. Or it could just one shot by itself. Wow. Oh, it was a crit. Dude, Azula's getting all the crits. All the crits today. That's nice. That's nice. There's no, s there's no single strongest Pokemon or soul best trainer. That's why it's difficult to keep winning. However, I think the hearts and desires and strengths strive you to grow and. Sh I don't know. That's why I respect you because you have these things. Now you have to become the strongest trainer in the Pokemon League. The statue of the Central Chamber will take you to the Champion's Room. Alrighty, let's go. Let go. Alright, so we got Iris coming up next, the champion. The champion herself. Let's heal up real fast, using the last of my hyper potions. Go to get full health on everyone. Absolute full health. Um Do I have any elixirs I want to run or anything? I don't have anything else I can put in. Alright. Looks like I'm in as good a position as I'm gonna be. Okay. Let's go on and fight the champion Iris. Do 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 Alright. Okay. Moving on up. Okay, so let's see. Somewhere in this area. Oh, it's not symmetrical. Nice. <laughs> stairs! I can't do stairs! Let's see. Oh my god. So many stairs! Oh. Welcome, Challenger. Bana! I've just I've been waiting for this. Iris looks so fancy. Look at her whole area. This is so cool. All right. Do do. Know what? I really look forward to having a serious battle with a strong trainer. I mean, come on. The trainer who makes it here is the trainer who desires victory with every fiber of their being, and they are battling alongside Pokémon that have been through countless difficult battles. If I battle with people like that, not only will I get stronger, but my Pokémon will too. And we'll get to know each other even better. Brace yourself. I'm Iris, the Pokemon League champion, and I'm going to defeat you. Oh, that's such a cool battle picture. <laughs> I am a scary dragon. Start with a Tyro. Yes. Yes, please tell me the champion goes with Scrub Pokemon. All right. All right. Fake out, you bitch. Why isn't there a fighting version of uh, Aerial 8 yet? I'm surprised there's not a Pokemon that has that. Like, it's it makes normal moves into fighting moves. Let's see. That should be, like, Hariyama's hidden ability. Just to make him relevant. Alright. Sing out a Tepig. Yes! 
Yes! <laughs> this is gonna be so anticlimactic if all she's got is like scrub first evos. But it's so good. Uh this is this is the best this could have possibly been. <laughs> but watch, she's gonna throw like a Mewtwo on me. I know it. I know she's gonna have something silly. Oh, 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 oh wow! Dude! It survived better than any of the uh, rock Pokemon that I fought. You got a head smash. Holy shit. Oh, Rocky Helmet. Yeah! Technically a one-shot. Still technically one-shot it. Alright. What do we got? Whimsicott. Whimsicott. Let's see. So probably Staraptor is going to be my strongest hit. Doobie doop. Okay. Um, Shabraper? I think I'll fly. I think I'll go for fly. Wow, Hurricane, first move. That thing's hella fast. Ooh, he did some damages. He did some of the damages. Alright, so he missed this. He missed this. That still hits? No! No! What? Son of a bitch. That doesn't make any sense. How how can a move that has like less than 70 accuracy still land on a fucking flying Pokemon? I call bullshit. That's no, no, no. That's ridiculous. Um. You're not flying type, are you? What type is Whimsicott? I don't think he's flying. I'm gonna try and figure it out because I think if, as long as he's not flying type, it's very in sixth gen he's grass fairy. Um, in fifth gen, fifth gen, just grass. He's just grass. All right. So I'm gonna X scissor him and see what I can do. This hurricane bullshit, man! If I tried to use hurricane, I would have missed all three of those. Man, I, I'm serious. I would have missed all three of those hurricanes if I tried to do that. There we go. I should just use Shuri. Damn it. I didn't want to lose Poof. I love Staraptor. Damn. Alright, Quillfish. Quillfish. It's poison type, right? So I should probably just earth power him. Probably. I don't know how I don't know how his resistance is. But uh, this is a really funny championship team. Like, this is a really funny team for the champion to have. Just like, I beat the Elite Four with these six Pokemon. <laughs> with your Tyrogue, Tepig, Quillfish, and uh, whatever I just fought. Holy shit. Whimsicott. <laughs> well, I guess the hurricaning Whimsicott will explain why you won. That bitch doesn't miss. Descend in Spiral! Goddamn Spiros. Seriously, that's so... That's so scrub. Please tell me this is her ace. Please tell me this is a level 60 Spearow that she's about to use. Spearow! Level 59! <laughs> it's level 59 Spearow! She has two Pokemon left. Oh my god, this is hilarious. It's a bit anticlimactic, but still, I'm not gonna complain. This is, I've had a lot of issues with this lock. This is like me. This is turning it around for me. I've lost a lot of Pokemon in this lock, so this is, this is making it up to me. The pain of my Pokemon, I feel it too. That's the first time she's taken damage and, like, not fainted. Drill Pack. Man, this Drill Pack hurts. It's got improved crit ratio, doesn't it? Come on. Oh my god, it survived. Well, it's probably going to Drill Pack me one more time, so I'm just going to heal up and it's going to take the Rocky Helmet and lose. I knew the Rocky Helmet on Guitar was going to be a good idea. Oh, never mind. She's going to heal. Maybe I should scald this turn. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna go for that. I'm gonna go for scald this turn and see if that does more damage. Cause I'm not actually ice type, and scald just has more damage. Damage. Wow. You take that rocky helmet damage. Please burn. Please burn. Nope. It did not do as much damage as I want it to. All right. Come on, just eat that one up, and we'll orb him out. 
Okay, so now we're on to the final Pokemon, which I guess it's only fitting that I should just use my, uh... My Palkia, who's basically become the MVP to win this battle. Honestly, though, I think the... Oh, man, of course it's Steel-type. Oh, what? I guess I'm not using Palkia. Wait, that'll probably... T I guess I am using Palkia. Honestly, though, the overall MVP of this whole series was probably the Lapras I had for most of the Let's Play. I mean, Palkia has come through here at the end, but I didn't catch him until very recently. But uh, Genesect and Lugia and Palkia are probably my top three. Um, maybe Excadrill. I ran Excadrill for such a long time. He did really well. I suppose I should just surf him. Cause I don't think he's got anything that can, like, one-shot me. Although I can one-shot him! Fuck you! <laughs> Automatize. What does that mean? Speed sharply increased, became nimble. What does that mean? No, not yet. We can't... We we can fight on! I don't see that, actually. Well, wow, he made him really fast. Skarmory's are kind of slow. Alright, there it is. Skarmory fainted. Sweet action. Well, the whole Elite Four took about 30 minutes. That's pretty awesome. I did my best. Got 1,000... Awesome. Or 11,800. Alright. I'm upset I couldn't win. But you know what? I'm more than that happy. I mean, come on. Having a serious battle? You and your Pokemon? Me and my Pokemon? And we got to know we one another better than before? Yep, we sure did. Okay, let's go. do 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 I don't know why that was the Mario Kart light sound, but that's, that's why I wanted to. Dude, whoever built this? Go ahead, hurry. Also, they built all this in like two years. Like, they had to rebuild all this shit after in attacked in, uh, what's it called? Uh, Black and White 1. This room is the Hall of Fame. Your name and your Pokemon will be recorded here, and some important things will never be forgotten. All right. So now it's time we run through a little, uh, little walk down memory lane. Come on. Oh, and excuse me, to trainer standing before me and to the Pokemon at your side, your beautiful bond has grown strong through this battle. In order to make this bond an eternal treasure, your name shall be recorded here. Do do do. All right. It's just like a healing machine. All righty. Yes. Yeah, oh, it's bug type. Awesome. Now, Sherry, we got Katara, beastly water type. We got Juvia the Palkia. We have Poof the Strafter, rest in peace. We have Azula the Infernape, put in surprising work. And we have Turnip the Cat Turn. I'm so sorry, Turnip. All right, Pokemon League Champion! Congratulations, me. All right. <laughs> easy mode unlocked. That's this advantage of playing white. You only get easy mode, you don't get challenge mode. Taking the easy key. Easy mode can now be selected. Keys can be transferred. Blah, 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 blah. Saving the power. Do, saving. Do not turn off power. Alright, guys. So while the credits are going to be rolling here, I'm going to explain what the next major Let's Play is. Because this is coming out. This finale right here coming out the week that ORAS comes out. This Friday. Oh, my God. This Friday, ORAS. And unfortunately, I'm not cool enough to have some sort of capture DS, so I can't record that as much as I want to. But uh, instead of that, me and my fiance are releasing a uh, a duo lock of Ruby and Sapphire, the original. Hopefully, we'll have the whole thing out bef uh, by Friday. The finale will come out on Friday. You get to see all that. We're going through it at a pretty quick pace. Uh, Glaze will keep going. I'm going to keep playing Pokemon Glazed, and uh, I'm going to be starting probably not next Tuesday. I'll probably take off next Tuesday and start getting recordings ready. Um, but I'm going to start a let's play of a full random. Everlock of Pokemon Pearl. Uh, if you don't know what an Everlock is, Everlock is basically, it's a Nuzlocke, but no Pokemon can evolve. I, I'm going to make sure every Pokemon's holding an Everstone. And I'm going to be adding a few extra little rules to make the game more difficult. Because I'm going to be full random, so they're going to be random Pokemon, random moves, random types, random abilities, random stat distribution. They're going to be fully random. It's going to be a whole new game. Like, none of the Pokemon are going to be what they seem. So it's going to be totally... It's going to be totally random and wild. So we're going to go through and... Oh. Never mind. Sorry. Looking at the pictures on the screen. 
So I'm going to be going through with that, and uh, I'm going to be making the game harder on myself, trying to play the game, make get the most difficulty out of Pokemon Pearl I can, because I've played so much Pokemon Pearl. Like, I've played the shit out of 4th Gen. So uh, I want to make that game harder on me, and so I'm going to be uh, ever-locking it. I'm going to be restricting myself on number of Pokemon, restricting myself on items, just to make the game harder. Hopefully I do better than uh, this randomizer. Um, because at the beginning, if the beginning of that one goes the way this one did... Uh, I don't have very high hopes for where that's going to go. But, aside from that, um, that's going to be my next Let's Play that I'm going to be starting up. Uh, as well as continuing Pokemon uh, Glazed. And keep an eye out for Pokemon Fire Red Omega. I'm doing, um, well, I'm going to do a speedy Let's Play of that. Um, I'm playing through that game so fast. Uh, I'm going to complete the whole thing and then up upload the whole thing like day by day after I finish uploading it. Um, and I'm just going to uh, complete that game pretty quick. I'm using the speed up button, like I'm spamming the hell out of that speed up button, but it's really just to get a look at the Pokemon that run around that game, because we've all played Fire Red and Leaf Green. We know what happens in that. So keep an eye out for that one. Um, and again, guys, thanks for everyone who's watched the whole series, who comes out, who supported it, who's liked the videos and everything. Uh, thanks for uh, everyone who's watching it after it's been released and everything. I appreciate it. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, and I feel like I've been improving on my Let's Playing as I've been going through this game. In yep, in Senpai with his restroom. I feel like I've been improving as I've been going through this, and my Let's Playing has been getting better. And I feel like Pokemon Glaze has been improving, and hopefully, starting with Pokemon Pearl. Less Pokemon, are <laughs> less Pokemon are dying, that's certainly true. I hope that my Pokemon Pearl Let's Play will be a new, higher quality Let's Play for you guys. Uh, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to like the video down below. If you enjoyed the video, if you enjoyed my content, go ahead and subscribe and see more. And with that, guys, I'm going to let this video finish. I'm Mark Random, for the last time Pokemon White, signing off. Thanks, everyone.